I see what's going on here. This isn't about slaves. You just don't want to hire a quarry. What? But... Uh, but... Is it because you don't want to feed them? Or do you just not like the suits? Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. And welcome back to Mass Effect 2. This is Hill, and we are here on Ilium after just completing the loyalty mission for Miranda. <laughs> I, have to, I have to think about it for a moment. Okay, so we have a little side we'll quest here. Out. Stop worrying. Let's Stop go ahead worrying. and initiate this. This is my life you're talking about. It's okay, I'll think of something. You said synthetic insights would buy me. You said it was an easy sale. I assume they would want an AI tech. Hello, can I help you with something? Let's ask what's going on. Have you made this quarry in your slave? We prefer the term indentured servants. Before you do anything hasty, know that this quarry and signed the agreement voluntarily and her servitude contract is completely legal on Ilium. If you actually want to help the quarry and convince the Synthetic Insights representative to purchase her contract, Let's ask about legal slavery. So slavery is legal on Ilium? Indentured servitude lasts a set amount of time or until agreed upon conditions are met. Ilium must approve all contracts. The law limits what restraint or corrective options I can use and what tasks I can legally assign her. I'm also legally responsible for her behavior and health. Abuse is absolutely forbidden. Hmm. Let's ask about the problem with Quarian. If slavery is legal, then why are you trying to sell the quarry? I don't keep service contracts myself. I'm a contract broker. I assumed Synthetic Insights would jump at the chance for a skilled AI tech, but they won't even make me an offer. Hmm. Let's ask about Quarian Slave. Why did this Quarian sign herself into slavery? I tried to play the stock market. I'm good with numbers, and I thought I had a way to make unlimited money. I lost everything. Then I got a credit line and lost that. Then I took out an illegal loan. You get the picture. As part of our agreement, I paid off her debts. Five years from now, she'll have a fresh start and excellent work references. Okay, so what if Shepard buys her? What if I bought her myself? I could let her go and everyone would be happy. A gallant offer with three problems. First, her technical skill merits a contract of several hundred thousand credits. There's also a fee for freeing me before my service period ends. Exactly. And finally, you are clearly a traveler. Her service contract requires that she remain on Ilium. I don't want them to take me off to a mine somewhere. Okay, well... Can't buy her. Alright, he'll try to help. I'll talk to the Synthetic Insights rep and see what I can do. Really? Thank you. I'd appreciate that. Alright, and she is down here. Whoops, sorry about that. Was that Miranda I bumped into? Sorry, so Miranda. Oh, Alright, let's see what she has to say. Can I help you with something? Hmm, would you like a Quarian? How would you like to get your hands on an expert Quarian AI program? If you'd like to submit a resume, I... Wait, is this that slave? Synthetic Insights has no interest in purchasing slave labor. We're under enough scrutiny from the Citadel without engaging in practices the Council disapproves of. To be frank, we're hardly hiring anyone. The Geth attack on the Citadel didn't engender much love for artificial intelligence. Uh-oh, people. I know you see it. We're going with this red renegade option. You're prejudiced. I see what's going on here. This isn't about slaves. You just don't want to hire a quarry. What? But... Uh, but... Is it because you don't want to feed them? Or do you just not like the suits? Synthetic Insights has a strict non-discrimination policy. We don't just hire indentured servants. Maybe I'll take this to Ilium's Trade Bureau, just to be sure. Wait, let's not do anything crazy. We don't want to waste the Bureau's time. Okay, fine. I'll go draw up a contract. Just leave Ilium's bureaucracy out of it. This quarian had better be good, though. Hmm. I tell you, Shepard knows how to rile up 
the Asari. <laughs> he really does. All right, five Renegade. That's what I'm looking for. But yeah, maybe because of his uh, intimate relationship with Liara, he knows how to push their buttons. All right, let's go back and talk to the slave broker. Synthetic Insights just sent over the contract. I cannot thank you enough. Hmm, I don't need your thanks. I didn't do it for you. I did it for her. Regardless, a kindness to her is mine to repay. Here, for your trouble. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'll get this service contract transferred. Thank you. I'll stay out of trouble this time. Ooh, 40 experience and two more renegade and 2,000 credits. Nice. All right, it's a good thing we stayed around. Okay, we are headed back to the Normandy because we need to apply some upgrades that we got from our last mission with Miranda. And I believe we have another quest that we can complete as we head back to the ship. And as you can see, folks, um, normally there would be someone here that would whisper to us about having um, support of the Rachni, but uh, we killed the Rachni Queen in the first Mass Effect, so there will be no such innuendo or contact with anyone. All right, let's go ahead and talk to this woman here. No, you don't understand. I lost it somewhere near the transport ter Pardon me, I'm dealing with damn Ilium travel bureaucracy. Okay, I found this. Excuse me, but I found a locket with a picture of a human and someone who looks like you. Oh, Stephen. Thank you. Thank you so much. My daughter was young when he died. This is the only memento she has of him. Please accept this. It's much less than I would have had to pay the bureaucrats to authorize a search. All right, 40 more exp... Oh, no, we got Paragon for that? Uh, all right. Oh, well, we helped out someone in need. Sometimes Shepard does that. All right, let's head into the airlock. bad you just can't go on board the ship because I, I just need to do some perform some upgrades we don't really need all these cutscenes and flying around in space all right so we're back okay so here's what we got submachine gun damage and meta gel Commander, you received a new message at your private terminal all right thank you Kelly let me go ahead and apply this So we have shield piercing that's been unlocked. Okay, plus 50 SMG damage it looks like as well. Okay. If I was reading that correctly. And let's go ahead and upgrade our meta gel. Okay, I think that will do. Alright, I don't think we can really talk to too many people since we're in the middle of doing their loyalty quest, but since we've completed Miranda's, let's see if Kelly has anything new to say. How may I help you, Commander? Is there anything I should know? You have unread messages at your private terminal. Anything else, Commander? That'll be all. Yes, Commander. And since I don't have any fish right now, with them all being dead, I don't know if she would even offer. I'm, I think I'm going to have to 
talk a little bit more intimately with her. We'll get to that in just a moment. Um, okay, only one new message. Yay! From Elizabeth Bainham. I remember her from Zoo's Hope. I'm not looking at the screen. From Zoo's Hope from the first Mass Effect. Okay, I heard about what you did on Ilium, and I wanted to thank you for helping out Zoo's Hope one more time. We're surviving if barely. Wait, I thought that other colonist said that they were doing fine. Anyway. Most of Exogeny left, but I stayed behind as an attache. That's attache, people. And to make sure that nothing was left of the Thorian. We don't need that problem again. Also, I'm really, really sorry that I shot at you. I'm pretty sure I said that, but I just wanted to reiterate it. Good luck and thanks. Zeus Hope is alive again because of what you did. All right. Thank you so much for that message. Wait, did I not? Uh, sorry. Now it's unread or gone or whatever. Archived. Okay. Kelly. How may I help you, Commander? Let's chat. You have a moment to talk? I always have time for you, Commander. I don't know if there's any new... Um, How options. do you feel about being assigned to the Normandy? I was handpicked by the Elusive Man to help fight the greatest threat known to humanity. How do I feel? Honored, exhilarated, terrified. But mostly I feel encouraged. Under your leadership, we can't fail. All right. That'll be all. Yes, Commander. I'm never going to get my fish fed, am I? But I guess it might help if I had fish to feed. What do you think, people? All right. Um... We need to head back to Ilium. We're not done yet. Okay, so we still have the Justicar to recruit, and the Assassin, and some intel I'm supposed to give Liara. I think that is the, the start, though, of the um, Shadow Broker. DLC, and we're not going to do that just yet. But let's go ahead and land. Now, I'm not sure when the appropriate time is to do Shadow Broker, but I like to be fully leveled up, you know, somewhere near the end of the game. Although, I think I could pretty much get through it without having all my abilities. I just want to have a few more. Oh, look. We can now change her appearance. She can wear the cat suit. Alright, so we're going probably to get Thane. Alright, I'm going to take Garrus and Jacob. Alright, so I've got three points. just hold on to them. <laughs> All right, Jacob. Still don't have enough. All right, so we'll just we'll put the thing in the incendiary ammo so it's a little bit more damage. And what have we got here? I guess uh Do we want concussive shot? Probably. That's good enough. All right. Okay, back on Ilium. By the stars, your skin looks amazing. You're not using biotics to touch things up, are you? Right, we've got another dialogue thing, a vista to talk to Garrus this time. We were always told that Ilium is one of the safest places in the galaxy until you fell off the grid. Sign the wrong contract, join up with the wrong company, or walk down the wrong alley, and it's as dangerous as anywhere else. Don't let this place fool you. It's no safer here than Omega. All right, let's go. 
How can you short sell on prefabs after these human colony attacks? They're going to see a ton of business. A ton of immediate charity. Bad luck on the stock market. Dead piling up. Perhaps you can have some other options. Listen, I know the data is vital to the Kurosa family. The son of Dantius didn't give us time to pack. I'm lucky I got out at all, for mercenaries were starting to shoot. If she lets us back in, I'll get it, I promise. If not, well, we'll just have to hope. Okay, well, I don't think we can interact with him until after we have completed the mission here. With Thane Krios. All right, folks, it's about that time. And we will continue with more of Mass Effect 2 in our next episode. This is Hill, and I'm out.